previously on Avatar. Hold up, hold up, hold up. You guys really just couldn't leave it at 200 days? Really? <laughs> If you haven't seen the other two, I highly recommend you check them out. I'll have them linked in the description. We have done a 100 day and a 200 day survival in hardcore Minecraft with the Avatar mod. Every day, or should I say every 100 days, are different. The first one was about us surviving and mastering every element. The second one was about us being in one with the spirit world and the normal world bringing peace to both. And then the third one, which is this one, is about me starting up our own civilization and pretty much bringing our own nation to, to, to birth. To, that, to birth? That was the wrong word to use, wasn't it? To do this, we're going to be using the Techtopia mod, which is a mod I have never used before. So if you guys want to play around with this mod pack for yourself, it is linked in the description down below. But with all that out of the way, I hope you guys are enjoying this new animated character, because he's going to be in my new videos now. Or should I say I'm going to be in my new videos now? Um, anyway, enough about me. Uh, let's just let's just jump jump into the jump into the video. I can already tell this one's going to be way shorter than the others because all I've got to do is just well start a civilization and. Uh, get some more armor. It's it's not as much as the other one, right? <laughs> the first thing I need to do is craft up the actual town hall because I've never used this mod before, so I'm gonna be so confused. But from what I know of the recipe, I'm pretty sure, let me quickly search it up, I need to make a town hall with every item or tool. So, oh, okay, I still need a hoe. That's fine, there we go. All right, so I, I, I have no idea what I do with this, but now I have it, so we can now use it for whatever I need to use it for. Now to build this town, I'm gonna need a bit of space and I have two options, either on top of this hill up here or somewhere else. <laughs> I, I, I didn't look, I didn't think this far ahead. I didn't even think I'd be doing past 200 days. So look, you guys can't blame me for this. You know what? I should probably, I should probably repair this, shouldn't I? Thanks to Riku burning it. I should, pro I should probably repair this before we even think about building the town because yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna probably actually need to do the item storage stuff later on because this was meant to be where all my items go. Oh, this is gonna take a while to repair, isn't it? Oh god, I hope not. All right, you know what? I'm 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 surprised that did not take as long as what I thought. Holy crap, that was really easy. I mean, it only took like uh I think I was on day 201 still when I started repairing it, but yo. Oh, I'm, so, I'm so happy with how it looks, man. I'm, I'm still mad at Riku. Riku is still evil, and I will hold that against him for the rest of his life, goddammit. But hey, at least this is repaired now. I think I've filled in every spot on the building, I think. Now, to get to this town, I'm thinking what we do is have, like, a stairway that leads up this cliff, and then this will kind of, like, lead into, like, a valley of houses or something. I still have no clue. I'm not good with building around mountains, so I don't think this town's gonna look good. I think it's gonna probably come out like crap, but hey, here's the hoping. <laughs> so far, so good. So I'm not gonna. I. Uh -huh, Blood Moon, just leave me alone for one week. Just leave me be, please. Let me enjoy my life. Ah, oh, goddamn. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna act. I'm gonna pull my pro strat. You know, I'm. I'm holding it off. Let's pull the pro strat. Yep. Uh... It's my pro strat. <laughs> I just <laughs> wait it out. Uh, you know what? Uh, I might just cut for, <laughs> for when I've built the stairs. Because I don't know how long I'm going to be waiting in this goddamn blood moon. Bada boom, bada bing, I have done another thing. Oh, these stairs, it's simple, but damn, damn, they're crisp. They're mwah, oh, crispy cream. I love it. I'm about to scream without the S because this stuff is that good. I love it. And it leads up here. And I'm thinking what we do is probably build the valley somewhere around here. I've got a few ideas in my head, like building a rope bridge and everything, but I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get started on building some things and see how it works out. You know what? Yeah, I'm happy enough with this. So this is where I'm thinking we build the houses and a uh, skeleton. Can you like piss off? Oh, you're indestructible. All right, that's cool. But I'm thinking we build maybe, we're not going to fit many houses here because these are the small house designs I can think of. We can fit a few beds in there. So we're going to have a few people live there. Uh, but I've also built these stairs. So in case we can, I hope, I don't know if our village is going to be big enough. We can come up here and maybe have the storage be my giant temple. I'm a bit unsure about it. But you know what? For now, I'm happy with this area. This area is clean, looks crisp, looks cool. Hopefully the villagers like it. I've got some ideas still playing in my head, but oh man, this is... It's really just me planning this stuff out. That's all this is so far. But my next major plan is probably building a rope bridge from here across to there. I feel like we can get a rope bridge going across this like area. It will look so cool, but I'm still unsure if I want it to go up the mountain or uh, maybe, oh yeah, I still need to get rid of that crap. But maybe, oh man, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, god damn it. I think we might actually have it cut through the mountain. So I'll build like a, I'll mine out a cave or something. Oh, that could look kind of cool. Oh boy, uh, you know what? I'm, you know, I'm keen. This is coming out clean so far. I, you know what? 
It sucks because all of this 300 days is just, it's literally gonna be time, cut, like time jumps of me building. I wish I had replay mod installed, but it, it, it isn't working for me. But so far, this is looking pretty cool. Just making it a little bit more cave-like now. And yeah, I'm getting sold on this, 100%. Putting some lanterns, I'm going to make it look, you know, kind of like what I did with the Twilight Forest cave. Make it a bit more nature-esque and have a path leading through. But bro, once I get this, like, like ladder, not ladder, the actual bridge set up. Oh, man. Oh, oh, I'm screaming again. All right, you know, I've just finished the cave. Let's have a quick little look at it. Oh, yeah. Oh, bro. Oh, man. I am definitely, you know, I'm not even screaming anymore. I'm just, I'm just creaming. This looks so good. I love this, bro. Oh, I'm so happy that I've got like that style now. I love it. All right, I think it's time we actually start on the bridge. I don't know how long this is gonna take me, but hopefully not long. Do I still wanna actually build the bridge in this location? Yeah, yeah, you know what? Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wing it. Let's just see how we go. Fingers crossed. You know what? Not bad. <laughs> this, hold up. Let's actually get to a good spot so I can show this bridge off to you guys. But, hey, this bridge, I'm, I'm happy enough with it. I wanted to do a rope bridge, but I thought one like walkway wouldn't be big enough. So I had to do three. They can cut through here, see some zombies. Lovely place. I'm happy as with it. I'm really happy with it. Um, Problem is, because of this stupid fog level, exactly where I build it, it's so hard to show what it looks like to you guys. Hold on, let me uh jump over here and see if we can actually have a proper look at it. No, it's still a bit foggy. Maybe up here? Oh yeah, hold up. There we go. So as you can see, I've added some lanterns down there. Bro. Oh, this looks good. That looks good. All right, there we go. So constructed a replica house over here. So now I'm probably going to make this one the bedroom and then we'll make the other one the storage in case it isn't big enough. If, if it is big enough, we can use our big tower. Then we'll probably make that one a bedroom as well. And this really zombies, you're still coming out of there. God damn it. I know you like that area, but piss off. I've got to light it up eventually. God damn it. Well, let's just flatten this area out a little bit. So I actually have something stable to build on. Uh... I think, oh, I, I'm tossing up on whether or not to make the town hall in here a bigger building or another replica and where to put it. Oh, I can put it either down there. Uh, man, mm, my brain. My brain doesn't like me currently because it's thinking of so many ideas. I can either, I'm probably going to build it down here. It's a bit of a bigger area. I can probably build a nice house down here and then I'll probably have another one. Mm, probably another one back here. So you walk in, there's the town hall, one over to your left. Yeah, okay. Yep, yeah, let's see how we go. Why not? Before I even get started on any of these buildings, let's quickly get rid of this black box. I'm not really liking it stick out of the mountain. It looks annoying. And, um, and, uh, can, are we actually not able to break it? Hold the phone. No, hold, please tell me we can break it. Please, please. No, no, <laughs> no, damn it. Ah, uh, this ugly giant black box is just going to chill here. Ah, uh, bugger me backwards, Ned Flanders. Wait, no, please don't do that. Oh, why is it so windy? Oh no, oh no, oh no, I'm like on the moon. Oh no, oh no, oh there's a tornado coming. Please, I just built all this, please tornado. Oh no, oh no, the, <laughs> look at all the animals, oh shit. Oh my God. Wait, where is, it, is it going? Oh, oh, look at all the wind. Oh shit, oh shit. Okay, if I took four, <laughs> oh my God, the mobs. If I took four damage, this would be really scary. Oh my God, look at them all. Oh shit, oh no. Oh no, I swear to God, if this, if this tornado destroys what I've built so far, I'm gonna cry myself to sleep tonight. I swear to God. Oh, but I, you have to admit, this looks so cool. Oh, bro. Oh man, if I if I didn't if I took four damage, I'd be freaking out even more right now. I'm more scared for my town though. Oh crap! Oh shit! Okay, so far it didn't seem to touch anything. We've built the town hall. Let's see if we can actually set this up now. No. Hello? Um, anything? Nothing's happening. Right click. Do I have to right click it out here and does it build the building? No. Um, uh, so apparently all I've got to do is put an item frame and then the actual town hall like that. And that should have done it. Oh, it's enchanted. Did that do anything? From what I know, apparently someone's meant to show up. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm a little confused about this. No one's showing up. Like maybe if I break the door and put... Oh shit! Oh, oh crap! There are people in here now. Um, sick. Hey, buddies. Hey, what's up? Tradesman, enchanter. Oh, so okay. So these are how I get. Oh wait, where'd the other? Oh no, he vanished. Oh shit! I should probably put the door back. Oh wait, no, no, it's ugly that way. I need to put it around the other way. But yo, dude, that's so cool. So a tradesman. I'm assuming the guy will show up eventually in a second. But I've got a home, storage. A nomad failed to find the village. What the frick? Okay, you're back. All right, sick. So yes, that's how it works. It just takes a few seconds. Bro, that is so cool. Oh, I love that. Hold up. Yo, wait, is that? Oh my God, that's actually, oh, yo, that's actually a villager. Holy crap. Hey, what's up? Demry Gold Rudder. Um, what are you doing here? Piss off. No one likes you. Go away. Yo, 
That's so cool. So what? Do they actually... Oh, yo, what? Are oh, you a merchant? Hold up. Merchant. Oh, yo. Okay. That's... I'm not going to lie. That is so cool. So I'm assuming new people show up every day. Oh, that's awesome. All right. Now that I know that, let's actually set these up. So I'm going to do my original idea, like I said. Make this one the bedroom for new NPCs and... There, bro. Oh, and it's color coded the beds. Okay, that's sick. And we'll make this one the storage house. Uh, but I need to go get some chests first. There we go. Oh, uh, this should this should be plenty for them, I feel. So if I put this here now, that should become a chest room. Oh, yo. Okay, this mod is cool. This mod is cool. I've never heard of this one, but this mod is cool. Bro, look how many are coming in today. Okay, so I have a. Mm, all right, so I actually have a mine shaft that I want to set up. So if I turn one of those guys into a miner, I could probably have a mine out an area for me. It's just where do I want to set up the mine shaft? I, I could either do it up here, but I feel like it would be hard for them to get up here. Or, oh, oh, I could actually set it up in that wall. Oh, yeah. If I set it up over in this wall, 100%, I could make it look cavey as well. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'm doing it here. Definitely mining it here. I don't know how I'm going to make it look, but I'll make it look coolish. All right. All right, there we go. So what? I just put the mine shaft thing there. Okay, it started glowing instantly. Sick. Uh, that's all I need to do for that. So now I'm pretty sure in the chest in here, I have a miner. No, a farmer and a lumberjack. Okay, you. Uh, no, you're the architect. Are uh, you? Uh, the tradesman, yes. That's butcher. There we go. Miner. Boom, bam, and bop. Okay, sick. So what? Do I assign this to any of the NPCs out here? I'm pretty sure they have, like, levels. So, like, you are a, a cake person. You're a teacher. You are nothing. Okay, you can be the miner. And boom. Mike Savage? Was it Mike Savage? Yeah, you... Uh, gonna mine, right? Right? Um, oh, oh, hold up. Yo, is he actually gonna do something? Oh, yo, no way. No way. Hold up, what's he doing? What's he doing? Um, what's he do boy, what are you doing? You place, oh, you're placing cobblestone. Why are you placing cobblestone? What? <laughs> um, dude, what's this dude doing? What's this dude doing? What are you doing? I have no idea. Okay, he's placing more cobblestone. What do you need? Oh, do you actually... Oh, he only might mine straight. Oh, yeah, he's mining now. Oh, crap. So they mine straight. I can't really tell them to go, like, tunnel downwards. Oh. Ah, that's a... <laughs> oh, that's a little bit annoying. I just want to see if he actually does break a block. Because it's taking him a little bit. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. So he does mine just straight. Oh, that is a little... A little problem. Because I don't think... <laughs> Hold up. How much, how much room does he have to work with here? Oh, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, not much at all. Okay. <laughs> all right, you know, I've decorated the area. How about I'm going to probably make it... Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to make a tunnel down, and I'll probably put at the certain, like, Y11, I'll probably make different tunnels for them to mine at. So I'll do... I'll let them mine a straight tunnel for me, and then I'll do, like, multiple mine shaft tunnels, and we'll have, like, an army of people mining for me. So let's just mine all the way down to Y11 and see how we go. I think I'm coming up on it now. I've been mining for a while. While 13. Yep, 12. Okay, cool. So this is the last one here. Boom. And then what I guess I could do is place a torch. There we go. I could probably just mine straight a bit here. And then I'll, I'll, I'll make this a mine shaft that goes straight. And then once he's done mining for a while this way, I'll then make left and right tunnels. Oh, oh, this could come out. This could come out. Cool. Hold on. Let's just make sure this works. So place that there. Yep. Let's go. Let's go, boys. All right, sick. I don't know why I slapped myself then, but let's go. All right, sick. Oh, 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 it's working. He's going down there. Oh, shit, bro. This is so cool. I can't stop saying it's so cool. It's so cool. Now that we've actually started our village, we need to get more emeralds. And the only way to get more emeralds is by finding villagers. So you know what we got to do. Ah, nothing's better than flying off to crash another villager's economy. You got to love it. Ruining the financial situation of other people. Ah, it's so good. <laughs> I feel like the government... Wait, no, I can't say that on YouTube, can I? Oh, yo! Oh, oh, I'm right near my base. Oh, cherry blossom. Oh, bro, I love cherry blossom trees so much. I want one I want one in real life. I want a mini one in real life, goddammit. Dude, and there's even a village here. Yo, okay, this village is low-key fire. Are these actually Tektopia villages? I want to make sure. Are the Tektopians here? Man, I sound like a like a like a super fancy person. Hold up. Uh, Tektopians? Oh, yo, yeah. oh, shit. <laughs> mini jump scare, but yes, they do live here. Cool. Oh, and they've even got their own storage sections. Are these? Yes, these are the spots where emeralds are. Okay, so if I find villages, I just got to look for the storage section. Wait. Oh. Uh, okay, it actually tells you when a guard's taking damage. Oh, that's kind of nifty. Oh, hello, skeleton. Yo, that's actually kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Not going to lie. Hey, bastard, piss off. Go away. Oh, shit, I can see him. Hold up. I'm coming to save you. I'm coming to save you, boy. I'm coming to save you. Let's go. Let's go. I swear I hit him then. Oh, no. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, no. I'll outlive every insignificant being on this planet. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm feeling like a Viltrumite currently. 
Oh, all I gotta do now is insert a line about me saying, Think, Mark, think! I swear to God, no one's gonna understand that reference. Please, piss off! Piss off! Piss off! Oh my God, this, yo, yo, hold up. This, this zombie, yo, wait, what? This zombie, bro, this zombie though. Piss off! Think, Mark, think, think, please! Piss, not leave me alone! I swear to God, people are gonna be watching this in like a week's time being like, what's, what's that? What's he saying? I don't understand the reference. Watch Invincible, good show. Anyway, back to Minecraft. I should probably keep saving people's lives. Oh, attempting to. Yeah, this really is like Invincible, isn't it? You know what? I will say that was a pretty successful ruining of an economy. I feel a ch I feel like an achievement has been lifted upon me. And yo, that swamp's actually kind of cool though. Hold up. Is it? Wait, this is actually a swamp though? Oh, that looks so cool. But so far, so good. I'm going to probably look around for a bit more villages and fingers crossed we get more emeralds. Yo, uh, what is this thing? A, a bounty board. Bounty rare. Uh, needs three diamonds and a skeleton kill. And I get two diamonds, one gold ingot and two nuggets. What? That's not worth it. <laughs> Bro, I love finding some of these new biomes. Like seeing the biomes in Biomes are Plenty, or what well, I should say with the advanced tree thing, looks so cool. This is a simple jungle, but it looks sick. Oh, the penguins. Oh shit, yo. Hey, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Now, hold up. Can I ride you? Oh yeah, I can ride them. Oh shit. Oh, this is so cool. Yo, look at me go, boys. Oh my God, this is so freaking cool. Oh, uh, if you're wondering what happened to my hat, by the way, it vanished. I don't know. So I'm wearing this copper one instead. The copper one looks cool, all right? What was that? Oh shit, oh shit, oh dragon, dragon. No, my auto penguin. No, <laughs> how do it, how could you? My heart has been torn into a million pieces. I I don't think I could recover from our auto penguin, from Gerald dying. That's what I'm gonna call him by the way. But you know what, <laughs> all jokes aside, actually it wasn't a joke, I'm deeply offended by it, but we have gotten plenty of emeralds. So we now should be able to buy a few things at least. So, I, oh man. I, Oh, I don't actually know what I want to buy though. That's the problem. <laughs> oh crap. But we do have plenty of emeralds now, so we can probably get some knights. We can set up a library. We could probably set up a lot of different areas. I don't, I don't really know if I want to buy any of this stuff. Probably, in honesty, we're probably just going to buy like maybe some farmers, uh, some knights and stuff like that. And I, yeah, oh, we might even buy a bard. Oh, yo. Okay. All right. We have some good money. Let's, yeah, let's get, let's get some of these. There we go. And start building up our economy. There we go. So we've got a second house built here. I don't know what's going to go there. But <laughs> we have one, so now we can use it when we need to, eventually. <laughs> All right, you know what? I think now we've got, got, we've done pretty good so far. Let's actually start adding some more NPCs around us. So we need to get a farmer. We need to get a few knights set up, maybe another miner. Yeah, I, I feel like, you know, yeah, probably two more miners, a knight. Oh, we only have one person here. You're a miner. Congratulations. Get, go to work. Actually, it's going nighttime, so you're not, you might not work, but hey. Eventually, work, please. You, good sir, are gonna become a knight. Yes, bro, that's so cool. Hold up, so you're a guard now. Hey, let's go. Oh, yo, what, they salute me? Bro, that's sick. That's freaking sick. Ah, uh, he said something about a bed. Do you need a bed, bro? Boy? Okay, yeah, you need a bed. Okay, that's fine. Let's upgrade Let's upgrade this two uh, house to a six house. Boom, bam. I completely forgot to show you guys. I built this farm up here. So now when we have a farmer, they can come up here, get some potatoes. We still need to get a, a I think a chef and a kitchen set up so they can actually smelt the potatoes for my people. So yeah, we still have to do that. But hey, we got a farm now, which looks kind of cool. And you know what? While I'm at it, I just built this little library. Nothing special. Uh, looks all right. I forgot it had to be a room. So I started mining out a cave and then I had to add a door to it. So it's literally just a little enchantment room. But I think the library means we can get an enchanter now, which will automatically enchant books and armor for us. And I'm pretty sure people will go there to read books and that build boosts their intelligence. I think. And I think intelligence means they know how to get to things quicker and they know the right path to go or something like that. I'm not 100% sure. I'm still learning this mod. Please know I'm recording this all in one session and I added these guys to some armor. I forgot. <laughs> Man, I'm just doing some big cuts currently. That's the problem with mods like this. I don't know what to include in the footage because it's just grinding out these small things and then showing it to you guys. So hopefully you guys don't mind. I hope. <laughs> let's actually see if we can get ourselves a few more villagers because none are showing up for me. So let's grab, uh, probably not you because you look like uh, an actual farmer already. I want some more knights. Uh, you guys look normal, sick. Let's just break this. So I want to grab these guys. I've got this chain here. I'm hoping I can attach it to them uh, and hopefully we can just drag them to our base. So boop. Um, no, oh no, we can't. Bro, we can't grab them. I have to wait for people to show up. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> that freaking sucks. Oh man. Oh, man. I sound like a uh, Sonic from that classic cartoon, Sonic the Hedgehog. Yes. <laughs> um, bro. Oh, what? Why are you sad? Uh, your happiness level's down. Oh, crap. Okay, so that means I need—I definitely need a bard. I'm pretty sure the bard, ha like, boosts the happiness for people. Okay, I need to do that ASAP. All right, let's just buy ourselves a bard. And that is that one. And that is 18 emeralds. Okay, that's almost all my emeralds. Sure. 
<laughs> sure. All right, uh, let's find someone to give this to. I don't know if they need a requirement. I'm just going to find a random person. You will do. Let's go over and boop. There we go. Sick. Uh, <laughs> Vincent. Yes, Vincent, our bard. Awesome. All right, we've been doing a lot of villager stuff for the last few minutes, but you guys probably noticed in my inventory. If not, well, I'm going to point it out to you now. When we were exploring, our Elytra got down to one durability, which I, I think is as low as it goes. I don't know if they actually break. So we need to actually make an XP farm to fix it. And I think I know where to maybe hopefully find an XP farm. Just down here, right by where we actually set up the mining system for our miners, there should be a lot of corridors and I'm hoping we can find at least a mob spawner somewhere. Whether it's a zombie or a skeleton one, I don't know. I'm going to be happy with it. Piss off giant bat. Sick. There we go. Uh, and let's just have a look around here. I'm going to grab also all the iron I see because, well, we could probably use that as much. <laughs> we could probably be very helpful to use that. So let's just keep looking around and hopefully we'd be able to... Are you... Wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Oh, no, I'm going to be sick. <laughs> Hold up. Wait. Yo. We, we actually found one. Oh, bro. Bro, we actually found one so quickly. Well... I mean, sick. I'm mean, up. Uh, okay, there's nothing in that chest or in this chest. All right, that's fine. I guess let's get started on setting up this mob spawning room. Sick. I hate how long this takes. Making four by four or four distance blocks in every direction is a pain in the ass. I hate it. Just cover up the floor and that should be it. Just to add some water, make the climbable tunnel for them. Sick. There we go. This is pretty much all set up and ready. Now I gotta do is break all the torches. I've added the water. Woo, there we go. Break this. Uh, I'm trying, I'm, I feel like I'm forgetting something. I've set everything up. Oh, hello buddy. Okay, yeah, I've set everything up, but I really feel like I'm forgetting something. All right, let's just break all the torches, make sure it works, and then we should be set. I don't, I feel like I've set this up correctly because in 1.12, there are no water elevators with like the whole like pushing up system. So what you have to do is like climbable ladders. Hold on, I'll, actually, I'll see if that works for him. I think I've set it up correctly, but they get pushed down here, land in this water, they get pushed over here. And then in this water, they will automatically start climbing it because of the distant, like the one block distance with the sign. So as you can see, this this zombie, bro, is all the way, oh, okay. He's all the way up there. So I'm just gonna, actually, you know what? We might actually leave him alive and see if he actually comes up. So then once they make it to the top, they get pushed down. Let's actually see if he shows up eventually, buddy, any, any day now, you know, any day is fine, bro. You know what? Really? Any day? <laughs> Did I kill him? Did I kill him? No, I didn't. Oh no, I'm still hearing a zombie. I didn't kill him. There he is. All right, sick. So he's gonna, yes, he's getting pushed. Then he drops down here and he should just survive. Let's make sure. And well, okay. He did not, he didn't survive because I hit him, but, but hey, hey buddy, what's up? Hey, buddies, what's up? Okay, we're actually getting a few in here. Okay, hold up. Hold up a second, boys. But now we have this all set up. So now, zombies should drop down. This thing should work, and hopefully, we should get XP from it. I don't think I have mending on anything else other than my elytra, but in all honesty, it's, that's, that's fine. These armors have such high durability. I'm fine with it, but... Um... No zombies are dropping. Hello? Zombies? <laughs> all right, how about some small adjustments? To, uh, I'm, I'm still waiting, though. Are the zombies going to fall at all? Hello? Uh, I'm still... Where are the free... Oh, there we go. All right, sick. Oh, let's wait for these boys. Okay, they do have a bit of health because they do spawn in at different healths. But, hey, yo, yes, it's working. Look at my elytra going up. Let's go. Okay, sick. Good to know this is working. And nearly there. There we go. And sick. That is 409 XP. I want to get it to max, though. Come on, zombies. There we go. Boom, bam, bop, and... We did it. Sick. I guess the next thing to do with our town is probably add a bit of life to it. And you guys know how I feel about cherry blossom trees. So yeah, just don't mind me. I'm just gonna uh, uh, just uh, just uh, uh, yeah. Actually, I should I should probably not cough into the mic during COVID. Oh 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 damn! I'm I think I'm screaming again, boys. Oh, this looks so good. Oh no, let's make this one a little bit taller, bro. Oh, I love cherry blossom trees so much. They look so freaking cool. Oh, bro, this is awesome. This looks so freaking awesome, man. What the frick? I was hearing some weird noises coming from the library. This dude's enchanting crap. Bro, imagine if this is the animation that played when you enchanted stuff. This look, oh, that looks so cool. And now he's always enchanting my items. Oh, oh, oh. 
Okay, well, I guess now is the time to show you what I've been working on next. We've now got a small kitchen set up, which isn't anything special, but now all the potatoes we harvest can be pretty much cooked up. And along with that, over here, I've also added some more cherry blossom trees. And we've got a few more NPCs set up, meaning we have a few more knights, another bard, a few more miners, uh, and one more farmer from memory. So, so far, our town is really starting to come together. It's really starting to come together. I love it. Oh, bro, this this is such a cool mod. Probably what I'm going to do now is because we've been working on the freaking village and town for such a while now. I think what we do now is maybe set something up up here once I deal with all the... Jesus, once I deal with all these mobs, I think we should probably... Oh, my God, there are so many mobs. Holy crap, bro. Oh, my God. I forgot what it's like in non-lit areas, dude. Oh, my God. Look how many mobs there are. Holy shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. But as I was saying, I think what we should do is probably set some things up here. I'm, I'm tempted to set up either a dragon's nest or maybe a building where we set up the furnaces for the dragons to use. Because if you didn't see the last video, Riku burnt down our goddamn temple, which I said at the start of this video. I don't want that to happen again. So I think we build something up here. And, oh, actually, oh, wait, that reminded me. We have the, the, the mod that allows us to make weapons from, like, different materials. I need to make one of those furnaces just so we've done it. Oh crap, okay, I'm gonna do that first. Hold on, I need to go get some grout, I think. And from memory, grout is made from sand and gravel and clay, I think. I really hope you guys know the mod I'm talking about. It's the one with the giant furnace and you can just chuck stuff into it and then like pour it out. Yeah, cool. All right, there we go. I, I think I'm gonna have enough. I think I'm gonna have enough. A few stacks of this stuff should be plenty to make enough sheared bricks and then make the actual blocks themselves, I hope. I was wondering what the freaking noise was. Oh, oh no, oh no. Oh no, it's another tornado starting. Please, please. Oh, God. Oh, we, we got lucky with the first one. Please tell me. Oh, I don't know if it's moving towards us or away from us. Oh, these look so cool though. Oh shit, it's got me. Oh, it's sucking me in, boys. Oh crap, this is hella sus tornado. You can't just suck me in like that. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. I think I'm safe in this tree. Okay, I'm just gonna chill in this tree for a second and hope things work. Oh, hello. <laughs> I, I didn't expect to find an L up here. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna chill up here until it's gone. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do that. There we go. We've got this furnace thing. I don't know what to call it. I think it's a, literally a smeltery. Smeltery. I'm just gonna call it a smeltery, but we have this thing set up now at the top of this, and I've tested it out already. It works with iron. So now we can start pouring some iron blocks. I'm, from memory, I'm pretty sure these actually can give you more. So if you insert like just under what four blocks would be worth, you get four blocks out of it. So it's actually a better way to smelt stuff down. Even though it takes a little bit longer, it is a better thing to do. And bro, I, I I, love this mod so much. I mean, this mod is one of the best mods out there. Can I grab my iron now? Please, please let me grab it. I don't care if it's hot. Please, please, just let me grab it, please. <laughs> Give me my freaking iron, boy, <laughs> please. There we go, all right, sick, <laughs> cool. And I had to start it eventually. I've got, to, I've got to start this. We got to start sorting out some of the stuff. As you guys can see, I've already started it for the most part. But item sorting, I hate it. It's going to take me a while, but in honesty, I need it. I need item sorting. I have so much stuff for it. <laughs> I have so much stuff. You know what? That was one hell of a time. Yeah. Oh, hey, I'm going to sleep. Oh, what's that? I don't feel tired enough. Yeah, that's because it's a freaking blood moon. <laughs> I've been setting up all the chests. It's all done, might I say. If we head down here, these ones don't have anything in it. But as you can see, they've all got item frames on them. But if we head down, these ones start getting things on them. Whether it's uh, dyes, nether stuff, twilight forest stuff, extra stuff, arrows, uh, rideable stuff. Bear, oh, not banding, goddamn, I'm losing track of my wordings. But all of this stuff is sorted. All of these floors have their stuff in it. I'm happy with this and we can add to it later on. And we still have some open chests for more things. And the bottom floor is all the blocks. Bro, I'm happy with this and I need to stop slapping myself, goddammit. I guess now with all that done, it's time we probably make some more room for NPCs because I need more knights and everything. I just want more NPCs exploring the place. That way it looks a bit more lived in. So we don't have room for any more buildings. So I'm just gonna make this area here another kind of sleeping area for our NPCs to live in. Yo, yep. I'm def yeah, I'm definitely happy enough with this. I think this looks pretty freaking clean. This looks clean, boys. And considering I'm in like a city building mood, let's also set up a tavern because our guys are still depressed. Even with our two guys playing music in everyone's ears constantly, which would, you know, absolutely cheer me up. They're just not that happy. So I'm thinking we build a tavern and let everyone get drunk. It's the only solution. Oh man, I feel like like Avatar Kyoshi would be so proud of me. Just <laughs> let alcohol sort the problems out, not me. <laughs> that's, that's the real way of the Avatar. Um... Oh, I don't know how big I want to make this tavern. I feel like this is pretty good. I might make it a little bit bigger. But yeah, I'm happy with that. You know, let's just actually, I guess, finish it off and see how it looks in the end. I'm just going to make it the same style as everything else. All right, let's just plonk the door down. And that should be it, I think. 
Um, wait, why isn't it lit up? Uh, is something bugged? Okay, that one's, yeah, it's, it definitely is meant to glow. Uh, okay, they, there's, okay, they're not coming to it. What the frick? Um, why isn't it working? Let me try replacing it. Uh, I mean, what have I done wrong? What the heck? I mean, it looks cool. What? What have, what have I done wrong? <laughs> I don't know what I've done. Ah, there we go. Okay, the problem was the stairway. For some reason, they didn't like the stairs, but there we go, guys. This room is all complete, and it looks mwah, magnifico. That's not a word, but I'll take it. I love that. Ah, oh, yes. Again, that was plenty of village work. Now, as you guys can see, I've already started it. I think we're probably not going to build anything up here, but I feel like we need to get our helmet back and our other set of ice armor from Sora. So first of all, Riku, please- Oh no, okay, I was the name in the ground. Riku, please don't burn anything down this time. Riku, Riku, Ri oh my god. Oh, Riku is still, he, he still worries me, boys. Riku, Riku, just stop walking. Just, just, just chill, bro. Riku, just chill. Just chill, okay, he's not gonna burn my buildings down here. No? Riku, 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 no, go back here. Oh, his eyes are red. Okay, <laughs> I just spat on my mic. Okay, Riku, Riku, okay. Uh, dragon stuff, just chill, chill, bro. Chill, chill, chill. Wandering, no, stay. Okay, sick, he's gonna, he's gonna smelt for me. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. I guess we may as well make a, a flame sword, considering we have an ice one, and we are gonna have to kill some more ice dragons later on. A flame sword's gonna make that way easier, so we can get some more ice blood. But bro, so far, the, I will say the only time I've gotten close to death is... Actually, no, I haven't really gotten close. Actually, the tornado, that's probably the scariest things. But hey, fire aspect or sharpness too. It's a flame sword, so fire aspect, duh. Hey, and we got smite five. All right, cool. Why not? I'll take it, I'll take it. Let's just enchant this helmet and add... Fire, okay, a fire protect and fire protection. Yep, that's that's what we want. Sick. There we go. We got a full set of armor back. Ah, oh, I still have no idea what happened to the original helmet. All right, you've done your job, Riku. Hop back in there. I think what we got to do now is let's actually go out and try and get some more stuff to actually make some more dragon meal for Sora because it's going to take Sora a while to level up and we only have 15 days left. He's not going to get that big. So let's just go get some more dragon meal and start leveling him up that way. I feel like that's going to be the quickest way to do it. Ooh. What is this? Uh, okay. So far, we're doing pretty good. What the heck is this? Um, is this a Medusa temple? Oh, no. Oh, it's a Ferris Rotnord. Oh, crap. I haven't I haven't fought one of those. Hold up. Oh, yes. Yo. Okay. I'm going to see how... Oh, okay. You know, I'm, I'm keen. Let's actually see how my new weapons do against this thing. So let's put my chest plate on. Take my electric off. There we go. Uh, I'm, aren't these guys, like, super strong? Hey, buddy. Hey, how strong are you? Hit me. Oh, oh, even with this, all oh, this armor, bro, that was nearly four hearts. Oh, that's painful. Oh, I'm just going to let my shield take the blunt force of that. Ow, okay. I need to wait for him to do a big swing. And are you going to do it, buddy? No, that's not a big swing. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on. Please, do it for me. Do it for a kiss on the forehead. Come on. You know you want one. Come on. Please. Kisses. Yes. Okay, Siki wants kisses now. This is my kiss on the back. And boop. That's not sus, boys. Don't judge me. Oh, okay. Wait, I just realized, yo, we did so much damage to him. Oh, okay, he set me on fire. That's fine. Holy crap, I didn't know this, this axe is literally going to one-shot him. Oh, you're dead. Oh, you're so dead. You're dead. Boop. Yep, easy. Bro, <laughs> oh, get wrecked, boy. All right, let's just give all these to Sora and hope he gets big enough to start breathing. Yes, oh, he is. Oh, let's go. All right, six. So now I guess we just leave him to do his thing, right? I mean, how long is this going to take? Okay, it's going to take a little while. That's all right. I hope he gets it done in time. Oh, God. Oh, it's going to be awkward if he doesn't. Anyway, all right. Fingers crossed it gets it done. Okay, boys. Let's go. Hold up. Let's go. Let's have a look at this. And boop. Oh, we did it. We have got a full set of fire and ice. No, that. Oh, take it off my legs. There we go. We've got a full set of ice and fire armor. Bro. Oh, this looks so cool. I've even added a few podiums just to put our things on. Like on this one, I'm going to put my elytra. There we go. And then on the left, I'll put my ice sword. And then on the right, my fire sword. Oh, bro. Look at that. That looks so freaking... Okay. I'm actually gushing. Bro, look at this. We did it. We've done it. We have achieved avatar peakness right now. Bro, oh, I'm so happy. Oh, my God. You know what? Considering we don't have much time, I'm literally just going to start decorating stuff. Like adding these fairy lights really makes this area pop. Like, bro, dude, this looks clean. It looks so magical. Oh, bro, I've even added, I've added some... Man, I'm actually, I'm actually freaking out on how cool all these NPCs really make this environment look. It really brings it to life. It makes it look so freaking cool. Um, but I've added some fairy lights down here. I'm a bit iffy on their location. I might move them. Yeah, I'm going to probably move them a little bit. I might make it get, like, over here and they connect to each other or something. 
But bro, this has been so fun. Like, 300 days? It, it's, oh man, I can't believe we've actually survived that long. This, bro, this looks, okay, this looks really cool. I'm still a little iffy on it. I might move it around, uh, maybe somewhere else. Hold on, maybe up here. And then we connect, oh yeah, this looks a bit better. So then connect one up here, up to this one. Okay, I have to need to climb the roof, but bro, I'm just, I gotta say guys, seriously, thank, if you've watched this far, I know this video is shorter than my others because it's all setting up stuff, but bro, oh, look at that. That looks so cool. Oh, I love that. I love that so much. That looks amazing. But like I was saying, thank you guys for watching this far. We've still got five days, so I still have some things I want to do. The last thing I want to do, actually, there's two things I want to do. Firstly, I want to build some statues somewhere just to show, hey, it's like a civilization. We built some statues here to make it look fancy. So I'm actually probably going to build those before I tell you guys what the, uh, the last thing will be. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They look clean. They look clean. And I finished them just in time. Hold up, let's have a quick look at these from a distance so you can see. It's two statues like kneeling on one knee with a sword in the ground. Oh, dude, I love them. They look so cool. Hold up, let's have another fly out and have another look around. And bro, oh shit. Oh, dude, 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 dude. That is, oh, oh, mwah. that is ma magnifique. I know I said that earlier and it didn't make sense, but that looks so good. Oh yeah, now with those statues built, I think it's time we do one thing that has been here since the first hundred days, but we have not checked out. We can craft a telescope, and this will tell us where a meteor is going to land. And apparently it has a full-on animation, so I really want to see that. Uh, okay, I thought the game froze for a second. We don't have long left, we're about to go into our final night, and technically I can use day 300 if I really need to, but let's craft ourselves a freaking telescope, and oh that's right, all my stuff's up there, and hope we can find ourselves a meteor, because I want to see what that looks like. I want to see some meteor action, damn it. Alright, we got ourselves a telescope, let's see how this thing works. So what, do I literally... Oh, wait, sighted a meteor, expected crash between... Wait, oh my god, I have to wait 32 minutes for this thing to crash? What? <laughs> Hold on. Uh, can I just... Uh, uh, oh my god, is that actually a countdown timer? Oh no, my telescope broke! Oh no! <laughs> god damn it. I have to, I have to make another one. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm thinking... I'm thinking there's got to be a command to, do, to actually get a meteor to crash. Because I need to see it, and I'm sure you guys want to see it as well. But you know what? Before that, I just need to say thank you guys for watching so far. Th this is insane. The fact that you guys wanted 300 days... In Hardcore Avatar Minecraft is insane. If you haven't seen the other two 100 days and then the 200 days videos, be sure to go check them out. They're going to be linked in the description down below. But if you have seen them, then I want you to say in the comment section, Avatar for life. Because seriously, I, I'm I'm blown away with the support you guys have shown my channel and just how insane the Avatar community is. I, I'm in love. So thank you guys. Thank you guys so much. But anyway, enough lovey dovey crap. Let's let's see if we can find this freaking meteor. Okay, so I Googled it. Apparently there is a command I can use, which is like hash slash meteor or something. So we might try that. One snow mobs are attacking me. Let's try it. Uh meteor destroy! Oh, 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 God damn it. Okay, wait, so destroy second drop item. Wait, 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 wait. Meteor destroy. Okay, so what? Do I enter my like chords? Okay, so what? Meteor. Uh Okay, so I guess I just entered the chords route. Hold on, I want to, I want it to crash over here. I want to see this thing like crash to like a soft surface. Hold up. Oh shit! Oh my god, it actually worked. The command worked. Hold up. Oh, it's gonna happen. Oh, creepers, back off. Oh, here we go. Ah. Uh oh. 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 Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh. My health. My health, please, please. Dude. 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 Oh my god. Look at the destruction it caused. Oh my, it hit the trees all the way out here. What even? How did it do? I am speechless. Bro, my game is struggling. It is freezing. Oh my God. Let's try it. I want to try that one more time, but here instead. Oh my God. Yeah, we're trying that one more time. Hold up. Let's try that one more time. So that's the command. Meteor started. Uh... Is that it? Wait, is that it over there? Yep, that's it. Okay, let's move back. <laughs> okay, let's just jump back for a second. I swear to God, watch me die to this. Me just trying to spawn in a meteor for you guys. Hold up. Let's have a look at it. Yo, here it is. Oh, crap. Yo, that looks so cool. Please don't kill me. E Uh-oh. Bubble. Just get. Okay. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm hearing thudding. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my God. I'm on fire. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, my God. Yo. Look at this destruction. Bro. Okay. Okay. Um, part of me wants to try a thousand. 
I feel like this area is perfect. There's trees around it, but there's a giant flat area. It's nice and foggy. There's some cool owls and crap. Let's, let's do it. Why not? Oh, and look at that. We're at day 300. All right, let's do this command. So boom, and then, oh wait, I need the, the thing. So boom, and then I just need to change this. Oh no, to a thousand. 30 second countdown. And we've got two, eight, two, six. Oh my God, this is going to be absolutely ridiculous. Uh, I swear to God, I hope I don't die. Part of me wants to try and like cheat so we can, you know, survive it. But, oh no, where is it? Uh... There it is. Okay, it's coming in. Let's just move back. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be bad. Oh, I'm so going to get hit. Okay, let's see it. Please don't hit me. Uh, okay, let's see it. Oh, this is bad. A jump in the air. And hit. Oh. Oh. Ah. Uh, the game's trying to load it. The, tr the game is actually trying to load it. Oh. Oh, the ringing noise. Oh no. The tree. I saw the tree. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. Oh. There's the fire. Oh, wait, how many of the trees did we affect? Oh my god, it's actually. Fire's actually spread out here. Bro, oh, we pissed the dragon off. I'm hearing the dragon. Hold on, let's actually see what we did. Okay, in all honesty, not that bad. This is a thousand? I would not have thought that. Okay, the spread though is huge. Holy crap. Oh, man, we're even burning this forest. Oh, my God. Wait, how far did this fire go? Bro, this fire spread. Oh, my God. That is amazing. That is insane. All right. But there we go. That is it. We did it. We have technically done everything. Okay, you know what? Just so we can avoid some of the lag, let's head back to our base. Well, guys, that is where I'm going to end this video. Thank you so much for watching. Again, it really does mean the world to me. I am blown away with the support you guys have been showing my channel and everything. I hope you did enjoy this video. We achieved quite a bit in this one. The last video was fighting bosses and stuff. This one was more setting up an actual economy. And well, sure enough, I feel like we've achieved it. We've got tons of, well, we've got tons of stuff set up, tons of NPCs, this amazing bridge, which I'm still gushing over. Uh, I'm just so happy with how this has come out. I. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. It, it was so fun to make and 100% I've also updated the mod pack. So if you want to play the 300 days version of the mod pack, it is in the description down below. Same link as always. But if you want to get the 100 pack or the 200 day pack, they are also linked on the same page. Oh, you need a pickaxe? Okay, I'll sort that out off camera. But anyway, guys, my name is Troy. I don't know who's going to be doing the outro, whether it's me or me or both of us. You know what? How about we make it both of us? I hope you guys did enjoy this, and I hope you guys did enjoy the brand new animated character, which I would have talked about at the start of the video. It, This is awesome. I'm so thankful. Thank you guys so much, and I hope to see you in the next one. Anyway, see you guys! Meow!